Hey guys, it's Rosalyn back at you one more again. I hope everybody's doing good on this fabulous Friday. Um, if this is your first time coming to my channel, thank you for coming and seeing what I'm all about. Everything on my, my channel is just straight positivity. Things on steps to be a better person. Anything positive, you're getting it here. So if this is your first time coming, thank you. Welcome, namaste, love, and blessings to you. Please like and subscribe. Hit the notification button so you'll be the first one to know when I'm getting ready to upload a new video. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, fam, and welcome once again. Today, my video is about Twin Flame 101 Laws of Attraction, how you can make it work for you. Man, I'm just a work in progress because, see, I'm working with you while I'm doing my own thing, too. These videos make me feel so much better and it's helping me as being a better person, being the better person I am today, where I was supposed to, meant to be. I was supposed to be meant to be. You know, um, laws of attraction, things that you want for yourself, they're never going to be easy. I've said it in many videos before, they are never going to be easy. Anything that you want... You have to be hungry for it. I mean, really hungry for it. I have to listen to a lot of motivational uh, videos. I've listened to Wayne Dyer. I've listened to Les Brown, Abraham Hicks, uh, Infinite Waters. I mean, they have taught me so much. And on top of everything else that I'm going through with my dad, and it's just with life really in general, you know, with your, you know, your home life, your work life, you know, <laughs> life period. What do you want better in life? You have to be hungry for it. You can't just wait for it to just, you know, fall in your lap and just say, okay, I want this. <laughs> you can't be a genie. You have to be able to work for it. It's like every day I try to figure out, okay, what am I going to do next? What's my next step on being what I want to be? You know, making these videos. It, it's, it's just like you have to write down things that you want. Say it repetitively. You have to... You know, instill it in your mind. This is what I want. You can't say, I will try, you know, or it's going to happen when this happens, or it's going to happen when I have this much money, or, oh, I'll put it off for tomorrow. Don't never put nothing off for tomorrow that you can do for today. And I have to learn that because sometimes <laughs> a girl get lazy. Because <laughs> it's just, especially if you have so many things going on, you can be emotionally and mentally exhausted, but that's okay. Just take a breather, take a rest for it. Ask the, you know, spirit guides, look, I, I need to take a break for a minute. And I've, I've asked, I had to ask a couple of times, please can I just go ahead and take a break just for a minute. Just, just to, just to let everything sit in. But then after that, get up and get to moving. You, you know, at any time, if you need that, that extra boost, like if you can't feel like you can't get it on your own and you need that person, you need somebody in your life that is on the same level as you, not wanting to just wait for things to happen, just like if they're not happy with the current situation they're in and they just complain about it and don't do nothing about it, you don't want to be around anybody like that because all they're going to do is sit up there and complain, but when you are ready to make a change, you are going to make it happen, I've done it trust me i keep on doing it if i'm not happy in my situation i might complain about it but guess what i'm about to make moves i'm about to make changes people do not understand it it's not meant for them to understand this is my journey you have to, you have to keep telling yourself this is your journey, journey. a lot of people are not going to understand your journey it's not meant for them to understand as long as you know what you're you're meant to do you have to find out what your purpose is on life on why are you here why are you here? Like right now, listen to this relaxing female energy meditation music and it just feels good. You just let it all soak in. Do nature walks. If you can't find out what is my purpose in life, do a nature walk. Get quiet. Get one with nature. And then you'll probably get your answer right then and there. If you're not happy with your career, you're not happy with your home life, change it. Change it. You only, you only person that's stopping you on doing what you need to do for you is you, the person in the mirror. That's why I have to keep telling myself every day, work on your affirmations, believe it, have faith. You can't just do it and just like, um, 
you know, wherever it takes me, it'll take me. You can't have that kind of attitude. You're just like, you know what? I got faith this is going to happen. You know, I want this to happen for my life. Write down what you want to do in your life. What what kind of goals did you, not goals, but what kind of things did you want to do in life that you want to set for yourself? And then when you can go ahead and meet to that goal, you know you are doing it. That's when you know things are manif- manifesting for you. Like every day I say affirmations and I see my views growing. I see myself becoming a better person. I can see myself being able to solve things better because before it was just like first starting this journey, things were so confused to me like, dang, what do I do for this? What do I do for that? Or do I still deal with this person? Do I still deal with that person? Anytime when it, when things like that come to where it makes you feel like you're in a halt in the road and there's just a fork and you don't know which way to go, things usually unfold to you just in perfect timing for it to make it a better decision for you. Just ask for signs. Just just ask for signs. That's what I do. Five, 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 buckle your seatbelt. That's what I'm talking about, baby. But you have to be able to be hungry. You have to have that frequency, that vibe that, you know what, everything is going to be okay. It's just like when I have a close friend of mine, it, it's just like we're each other's cheerleader. It, it just feels like with her, you know, when things get down and out for her, I have to be just like, you know what, you know, this is the proof that we keep, we're going to keep going through stuff like this. It's not to bring us down to just, discourage us or anything like that is to make you stronger to make you grow from your lessons grow from your experiences to be able to tote it up under your memory cap to be able to you may be able to use it down later on down the future and when something like that comes up you're like aha i've been through this situation before how did i deal with it okay so you learn how if you look at things from a totally different perspective you'll be able to know what you're going to do in life and you're going to be able to succeed do what you need to do so like i tell you meditate pray have faith in whatever you want that you will succeed will succeed in anything that you want set affirmations for yourself not goals because usually if we set goals for ourselves a lot of us can stick to them and a lot of us can't so stick affirmations to yourself if there you know there's things that you want to do in life this is all you have to do. Set affirmations to yourself. I used to just do it one time a day, bump that. I started doing it two, three times a day. And then I started seeing things speed up for me. I work for you. You know, don't let the, the life work for you. You let it work for you. You know, don't let life work at you. You let it work with you or for you. Don't never let, you know, don't ever let, let it sit up here and get too hard for you. Don't ever let it happen. And this is all I got to tell you guys today. You know, just work on your affirmations to be a better person. The things that you want in life, trust me, it'll happen. It's not going to happen overnight. It's not going to be easy like that because anything that's too easy is going to be like a microwave dream. That's what I call it. Because anything that happens just like that, it usually leaves as quick as it got here. So make sure you work hard at what you want and believe in what you do and be around people that believe in you too. And I will talk to you later. Much love, peace, and blessings. Namaste, peace, and be wow.